This is an information video for Math 105 course for four credits. There are three main features of the course, mindfulness of learning, flipped classroom, and redesigned content. Mindfulness of learning, we're teaching you how to pay attention so that you can address math anxiety problems. We're also teaching you how to take more active role in your own learning as opposed to just coming to class and listening to lectures and becoming passive recipients of knowledge. We develop vocabulary so that you can learn how to express what you do and do not understand. We try to convey the essence of mathematics by teaching you how to read and speak correct mathematics and also how to write correct mathematics, increasing retention, not just for this particular class, but for the next course for which this is a prerequisite. We will teach you how mathematics is all about becoming comfortable with your own discomfort. We encourage observation of thought processes while solving math problems to bring about positive change. This is a flipped classroom, which is very different from a traditional classroom. In a traditional classroom, you come, you listen to a teacher lecturing, you go home and you do problems. When you're solving problems is when you need help and you need a teacher right then. However, if you're stuck at home on doing problems, then you come to class and you can only ask so many questions because there's only a limited amount of time because new lecture is coming at you. This creates a vicious cycle in which a student can get stuck and not be successful in a particular class, especially in this level of mathematics classrooms. So in the flipped classroom, at home you're going to read the textbook or you're going to listen to the lectures, whichever you happen to prefer. You come to class prepared and in the classroom is when you solve problems and the teacher will help you when you're stuck. This allows for better retention and it will allow you to become more successful in your next class. This course is being tried out at many different campuses and we have tremendous success and we hope that you will consider this different way of learning. The responsibility for a student has now changed because you're listening to lectures or reading the book at home and then you're solving problems in the school. The redesigned content has modular learning so you're learning things in smaller chunks so that retention is increased. We also provide you insight into higher level mathematics and at the same time we review some of the prerequisite materials in case you have forgotten. We use visual interpretations and solutions which allow students of different forms of learning to master the material. Mastery-based learning is a key component of this course, which means you are required to get 80% or higher in each module, which means you'll have to retake exams. All exams are untimed, that allows for students who have math anxiety to be successful in this version of the course. We teach you to articulate mathematical reasoning, increasing your success. In the modular learning, we have five modules. And the first module is study skills and psychology of learning, giving you techniques on how you can overcome some of the anxiety. The next module is introduction to vocabulary, getting you familiar with the terminology being used in the course. Next module will give you arithmetic, which is learning how to add all of these objects, then subtract all of them, and so on, seeing patterns between the different processes. Next module allows you to solve equations and inequalities simultaneously, trying to draw parallels between the two processes, allowing better retention. A lot of times people finish the course and feel where well, I'm going to use this so the last module is focused on applications and graphical representations so you see the value of what you're learning in other disciplines. We hope you will consider taking this class and thank you for giving us this time to give you more information on why you should consider the four credit class.